this fucking thing and all. Fucking him. Paraguay shite. Get rid of it. He hasn't scored, I don't know, since we've got this flag. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Alice Man Face of Podcast. Oh, dead, was it on there? Was dead it? Dead negative, you. Oh, For God. your prediction, V, man, you. Stop being negative. Really? Yes. So you want, or you want to be positive? Yes. Right, we'll get B5 now. What do you, what, all right, Mark, get, get, get me after the positivity. Come on. So, the so star lineup, do you want to see any changes? Obviously, Hayden's not going to be there. Hayden's going to make eight. Hayden's not going to be there. That's what I said today. Can I make eight changes around the day? That's what I said. Eight changes? I'm on it. 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 to bring it to the team. Eight changes. Well, he wants Mighty Longstaff in his dad or something. Right. I know Dubravka <laughs> <I know Debravka, laughs> had a bad game. Like, Good hockey player. He's if I see Dolo in there. Debravka's Debrav- Debrav- starting. Yeah, of course he is. Of course he is. So, who are the eight players? I'm, I'm who on said eight? I read the paper on the press today and they said there's eight changes. Yedlin, maybe. Maybe. no. Key. Yes. Key, yeah. Key so then we I'm going to have six changes to go. Oh. Saint. Saint. Shout. Who's Carol? Carol? For? Or Carol Con. Are you going to start Carol? Not meant to be fit until like Easter or something like that, is he? So. Muto. You know what it is? Well, I'd, I'd, I'd go. go. Right, let's start from back. Dubravka. Yes. Right back, Yedlin. I'd, 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 I'd go back to three at the back. Yeah, you've got to. You've yeah. got to. Right. And I would play. Do you I, know what it is? I'm dropping the cells. I'd. Fernandez in. Nah, yeah. I'd, I'd bring Fernandez in for Dummett. I'd go eight at the back. It's Kieran Clark fit. And then <laughs> yeah. I'd go eight at the back. Eight at the back. Yeah. We've still got Grant Hanley. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> it, honestly. <laughs> he, he, he is still the worst footballer I've ever seen in a <laughs> And his team <laughs> still managed to. I, I still have. I still, still wake the team up that us. In the middle of the night and remember that performance from him. Oh, God. Right, so. So, so it'll be Dubravka, Yedlin. It's going to be Lascelles. It is. It is. It well, is. It'll be sure Lascelles. Dummy. It's going to be the same. Likelihood is, yeah. Who's, who's left back? Is, I, I, is she fit? I actually think yeah. Shea. Nah. Richie's still... F- Willems? Can you see Willems coming back I, in? I, I think Shea won't play. There's my, there's my, I think really? Fernandez will be in for Shea. That's what I think. Fernandez should be in for Dummy. Like, so he's the last defender I'm taking out of there at the minute. Like, I'd rather oh, see... I'm, I am yeah, not yeah. saying... I'm just I'd rather saying. see Lascelles go or Dummy go. <clears throat> it's funny one, Shea, because I think he's probably the best defender there. With the exception of Shea. Do you, do you in, think deep down Shane knows he's gone in January? I, I ah. think Shane's got this thing about him where like he's he's uh, I, I don't want to say unprofessional because obviously he's a fucking He is, he's record winner. But he's, he's just I, sort I, of just, diving in and go out of position. He's and just, just fucking raj. He is yeah, raj. Oh, he's, 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 absolutely, he's a, that's he's, what I love about him. He's the first one that would like he, he, he'll go in and knee hand and someone fucking no bother. Yep, absolutely. He's a really guy. I, I think right, he'll, he'll he kicked someone, kick someone on the. Someone got past him before and he just kicked him, just kicked him straight yeah, down. And I was like, fuck, mate, you got, you got booked for it. Like. That's passion, that man. Do, do you know what it is? I, I think he's gone in January. Like, I, I think he's gone. I did. Nah. I don't know. Like, I think we'll see a lot of players if we're in the same I, position. You know what it is? I, I honestly don't think he's as good as we think he is. I agree with that. I, do I think he's class like he is a good player like but when I see him taking shots from 50 yards out and things like that I just think what are you doing I think that's the that's the yes, thing I, think I he's, agree he's got he's, good, he's a good footballer he's good on the ball and he can hit a ball like but there's something a little bit on him he's not he's, yeah, oh, he's dropping his heat like totally uh, <laughs> So I, th- I think he might get dropped, personally. I do, I think he might get dropped. I don't think I want that to I'm just saying I think he might. I think we will go back to three at the back, though, to be fair. So if we did do so that... So left-back, who are we going left-back, then? It depends um, if Willems It depends if Willems is fit. Yeah, yeah, it depends. I, I actually thought, I think Mankiel could do a job over there, but but that's just me. I'm not sure. He has some choice there. He's he's played played there. there. Yeah, yeah, your does. midfield, obviously, like we said, Hayden's not going to be in there because he did get the red it's card against. It's going to be Longstaff and Key, isn't it? It has to be. It's only two that you've got, apart from the, the young Longstaff lad, but... I don't think you'll get brought in against my There's new. No way, man. Yeah. And then you've got to go. You've then got to go. But you've got to remember. To Almiron as a two, and Joel Linton in front of him. Unless the maximum's fit. But then you, you've I got to remember if, if we pick another injury up in centre midfield, you're left with nothing. I've banged so we're going on to see Williams back in the middle. Months and months and years and years about our lack of strength and depth in midfield. Well, I know we've got four centre backs. We're just in a situation where one of them's injured. Shelby's injured. Four centre. Yeah, sorry. No, so, so, so centre midfielder. So Shelby's injured. Hayden's got the red card. So that's three games. So you've still got four centre midfielders. That that's more than. I. I, I, I Did anyone sign the army? Yeah, must have went somewhere. Yeah, Spain, not, even, did they not? I thought uh, some Turks. Do you know what it is? Looking back now. Why the hell did we... Well, he probably wanted he a three-year contract. He was too probably. old. That was the thing when it That's was why. Yeah. Too old. And he was kind of shite as well. Like, I, I think... Uh, yeah. I, 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 You'll see... He came in for a lot of unfair criticism. I think he came in for quite a bit of unfair praise. <laughs> <laughs> I loved him at certain times. He was one of them players. It was one of those ones where he, he, 
he had that that was his field of vision. It was perfectly ahead of him. So anything out there, like you, you're not going to see him to kind of turn to spray a ball up while he just like pass straight ahead. And a lot of the time he did it really well. But when he got it wrong, it was like something. I thought he was a lot worse when, um, like, say, uh, you know, I agree. Yeah. Well, like, say, Shelby was out of the team. It felt as if Diarmi felt, I have to now be the player that starts every move yeah. off. When he was just there to nail everyone that come near him, he pressed the ball better than anyone we ever had. The, the amount of times he used to win the ball on the, in their half, because yeah. they were, you know, passing it around, Diarmi would just step in and then would break. I think we're yeah. missing that, though. Because we that's it, you've got yeah. nobody that can just. Just stop. And I'm, I'm, I'm going back to their Even first goal. Even if it's goal, just yeah. getting in, in people's just, way. We've got no one in centre midfield. But their first goal proves that fact. It's just that we've got, there's a right but back you, you, managed you to run. You just sat there telling me that we've got four. Four's enough. Well, no, we have, but we're no. in a horrible situation now. Yeah. One of them's injured and one of them's so, had a right so goal. Newcastle four's United. Enough, it is. So massive. what do you want then? How many other teams are you see with five centre midfielders? Six well, centre midfielders? We're not in Europe. We don't do anything in the Cup. So you're going to have five or six centre midfielders to play for two positions. Four's more than enough. How, it is. how many how many centre backs have we got? So do do we need four players for for each position? It'd be nice, but it's not going to happen. Is it? Let's be we've only got one goalkeeper. Jesus Christ, the rest of them are shit. We've got technically we've got five. So, so how many centre midfielders do you think we should have then? How many do you think we should have? Callbacks one. You have to count them. Well, he's not. But he's not. He's not. Severe. Yeah, but they're not yeah. in the squad. Yeah, but they're, they're well. I but they were still they're still there though, aren't they? But you can't use them. But how many centre midfielders do you need in your twenty? Was it three man squad? Twenty five. I would have had. I would have had one of them in. So then who would you have dropped? Probably Kieran Clark. How many centre backs we got in there? We've got Fernandez, Five? Lascelles, Shea. Lejeune. Le, no, Dumit. Lejeune. Does Dumit still take a place because he's. <coughs> no, no, he's left back. Nobody's. Oh, he's, 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 he's home grown. I, I think if you're, if you're playing three centre backs. Is he left to work for that? I think as long as I've trained at the club, I don't think it matters. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. This is going like this is champion. I never ten years ago. So yeah. Well, we're gone, of course, yeah. We're gone, we of course, <laughs> we of course. So, my new game. What were we talking about? I don't know. <laughs> my new game. Let, let's just go for a prediction. Oh, well, we're talking about the team. Year. We have a team selection. Yeah, up, but all right, up front. Is Saint gonna play or not? Nah, I don't think. Uh, if he's not fit, he shouldn't. Nah. Is he's an impact player? We'll yeah, see how the game goes. He's, we'll an impact s- he's not an impact no, player. We need a fucking he's impact not. start. Okay, now he's hundred percent impact player. If we're buying impact players. For 21 million. Aye. Like. <laughs> That's, we're not like. We? We're not. Come on. Let's be fair. Yeah. He's not an impact player. We're not, we're not buying him. Going, He'd be mint if he comes on for like, an hour. Like <laughs> top teams pay that for, for backup players. Because yeah. basically that's what your impact player is. Someone that, that's second string to the rest of the players. <clears throat> we're players He's not. Start. He's if, not. If we, if He's we, at a start games. If we kept for the back. If we did. Which I don't think we should. But if we did. For this game. I'd, again. I'd love to see Almiron be behind Joe. Mm-hmm. And then Saint and Nato either yeah. side. That's what I would like to see. But is that a bit too gung ho, possibly, against this team? I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't have said so against Man United. They've got an awful defence. True, but we cannot go forward. Who will we play this Can't season? Not. Liverpool that doesn't have an awful defence. When you're talking about like Joe Linton and how he's yeah, playing, he's not. We're saying this every week. Harry Maguire fucking gobbles him up. Oh, yeah. he eat him alive. Yeah. He'd eat him alive. And I have to be honest here as well. I remember the home game against Man United. You're not like you know this, but I'm going to say it anyway. Lindelof absolutely owned Rondon and that shocked the life out of me. Lindelof owned him and I thought Rondon would have beasted him all over. Going back to what he's saying, Maguire will absolutely rinse Joe Linton. If, 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 if you're pumping up. And that's all we can do. That's all we're doing. Maguire won't use kit washed. Uh, he's right. He's right. Like, And I'm, and I'm going to go back. I know you disagree with this here. We only had however much possession against Brighton at home. Fuck knows how much we're going to have against Man United. Is Gail fit? Nah. No, no, fucking wish. no one knows what's wrong with them. <laughs> I'd like to see Muto on because I still think Muto done can he uh, while he was on. It, he was dangerous yeah, as fuck. He was dangerous. Agree, but we're not going to play. We're not going to play three maybe. behind Joe Linton again, are we? No, so score not. prediction, Storm, that side of the table once again. <coughs> if this weekend hadn't have happened, I would have been so a this bit weekend. more optimistic about this game, just the way Man United have been playing and, right. and that kind of thing. But even with a bit of op- Optimism. One one. That's really optimistic. Jesus, we'll just get me five nil. I know. Bestie. And it's just coke in there, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it is <laughs> coke. <laughs> um, G- Grady, a Colombian. My my optimistic leaning would be two nil to Man U. Mm. Um, they're not as good a team as Leicester. It was five past eight, obviously circumstances and all that. Like, mm-hmm. game, it doesn't quite work like that. But I, I think three nil, Man U. Two nil if, if we play really well, by our standards. Um, I was going to say three nil, like to be fair, that's just what I feel. Um, yeah. So I'm going four nil. Nice. 
that's fine. It probably would be. So yeah, I think <coughs> just just based on the weekend, the, there's got to be a reaction from from those players. There's got to be a reaction. Yeah, there's, there's from, supposed to be a reaction since the fucking but, Norwich game, mate. We've got against Spurs, well, then it's gone yeah. shit again. But after the Brighton game, I actually did expect. Uh, 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 um, what did you say? What was what you said? Um, reaction. Reaction. Sorry. Yes. Um, the thing that's annoyed is a lot. What I've seen the day on thingy Bruce has said. Um, we need to go back to basics. He's been saying that. That is reason. exactly what he He's said after the Brighton game. Yeah. He said we need to go back to basics, and he said it the same again. So I just don't feel anything's going to change. But to be f- to, to be <coughs> fair to him, he's right because they're not doing the basics out on the pitch. But he's got to take some responsibility for that as well. What, what, are, the, what are the basics? Like what are the basics? Well, no, basic what, what, is, what keeping, is keeping is keeping keeping <coughs> line just keep your, your shape. line in defence, keep your shape, closing down your man. Making sure that you're picking up runners and stuff like that. It's the basics of football that he's not that's, doing. That's exactly what they were doing up until he became manager. Yeah, yeah. yeah. they were doing the simple things, right? They were doing them yeah. really well. I, 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 I've, I've said this for years watching us. I always worry about where we're going to get goals from, right? And I said the same yesterday when I was watching. You watch other teams playing, right? They, they, they pass it around in such a way that they pass it through you. You know, and Brighton were doing it constantly, right? I keep using them as an example. For us to have a chance, right, of scoring, we're expecting someone to be three men every single time we mm-hmm. get the ball. Atsu has to dribble past loads of players and get a shot in. Sane's going to have to take the world on. We're expecting Almiron to pick it up from deep and just run at everyone. We don't actually ever seem yeah. to build it up. It, Do you know what I mean? Like It's, yeah. it's that same it's problem ridiculous. that, that we've been having if our two <coughs> central midfielders are sitting far too deep. They're sitting just in front of the back four. They need to get move themselves up the pitch because that is. Do you what think is they're good enough even if they did that though? I don't think they can pick a pass. I don't think they've got what, a breeze. Yeah, what worries well, me look, is, look, is look that back at pre-season at the start of the season when uh, when Hayden was making forward runs and getting into the box. Got to be three like one off numbers when he was I've doing never that. Never seen him do that. It's, it's for weeks and weeks. Well, what frustrates me? I, I can see a single player midfield picking the ball up and deciding to run with it rather than passing a move. So, so you'll see a player picking on the right hand side. Almir on prime example. He just seems to get it and just runs. Like yeah. well, look around, you see what's there, but, but it's not. It's just how fast can you get up that I, pitch? I know, but when with I, the ball yourself, that's that's when you then expect your midfielders to follow the play. The the don't the stay where they are, or they'll get a halfway yeah. and stop. I think you look at how Joe Linton was at Norwich, how isolated he was. I think that's an example of that. I think you're right. But in in the formation that they played against Leicester, you've got three players behind Joe that are fast as fuck. Let's be fair. Mm. Almiron, Atsu, well, Almiron. That's what we're looking forward to going into the season. Yeah. Like and the I, pace of the and team. that's why, I, as I still say, the first 10 minutes, you could see that. At least you could see that. that there were, and that's why you there need to get them in and around the Joel Linton mm. for those, those chest downs or little touches or something like it's, that. So that can get but, but again, though, as I still believe that the, we don't play any triangle football. We don't move yeah. the ball around at all. We expect the faster players to get the ball Basically, take everybody on and cross it in Joel's score. But this That's is, is this not what a, what a young upcoming manager would, would give to you? That sort of footballing approach? Well, like a triangle well, pass move? For example, you know? right. Have you, I don't think I've seen it. I don't think I've seen us take a short goal kick. We haven't. I think we're the only team that hasn't. Well, there you go. It's 2019, man. Even Rafa used to do short. We used to at least try and play out mm. from the back. You can't just lump it for. So, we well, just mentioned there about, gone, about Joel Lennon being, being isolated. I don't even think it's him. I think any single player that gets a ball on that pitch right now, they look like there's no one near them. 100%. I agree. I agree. 100%. Every I agree. single player on that pitch looks isolated. <laughs> and that, and that, and that comes to the fact that the midfielders sit in far too deep. Ah, but even when midfielders have got the fuck out, they're still the there's one there. There's still the one there. It Every seems like one player, and the only option they've got is to find someone further back. Yeah. There's n- there's no man. There's nothing. Now, is that a question of confidence? I, sh- I didn't really want the ball. I don't want to go forward because I just didn't want it. I, did. I don't it's want basically the case, I don't want to lose it. The, 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 That's what it is. The, the person that people's being given grief, maybe rightly or wrongly, I, I thought on, on, on Sunday, especially certainly in the first half, Almiron was trying. He was trying. He was running. He was run- Every time he got the ball, he was trying to be dangerous. He was trying to be. Um, I thought Muto looked okay-ish for a bit. I thought he was a bit unlucky he had to come off. He would have never come off if it wasn't for the second half. Should have buried that chance. Yeah. Yeah. Should have buried well, that chance. Well, maybe, but... 100%. But, but that, that's the best chance that we've carved out was a fucking missed hit shot. That's the best yeah, chance that we've fucking right. created, man. He, well, free kicks are diabolical. Yeah. Muto's run was fucking brilliant, but how deep he came from. He, he did, yeah. He runs past all in, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 and he just, just, yeah. Comes yeah. In. It's where I'm wanting Joe to be, to be really honest with right. you. I'm expecting Joe to be in that type of area. Actually, he was just behind him as well. Like a couple of yards back oh. as well, I. It's a great run by Mudo, obviously, I guess, I think I said, on the podcast. Though. But we've, we've, we've had, five games under your scores that. We've had the least touches in, in opposition's penalty area. We've had the least possession in the entire... I know you're not a fan of possession. 
but we will have the least possession. Come and find a possession if you do something with it. Yeah, but we're not getting That's it to deal with it. We're, we're, the bottom line is, on the ball, we are atrocious. And at the moment, we're absolutely atrocious. Off well, it. yeah. So, so, so we're, you're we're, fucked. We're topping all the stats for the negative things. Of course. Oh, yeah, we haven't, had a shot. we haven't had a shot from inside the six-yard box yet. Although but, Shea was nearly in the six-yard box. Our six-yard box, we had that shot. And we've played Watford, mm. who fucking... Just a hump and getting humped goals. And we couldn't even... You know what I mean? Like... We're not even creating chances really? against them necessarily, do you know what I mean? It's really concerning. So what scoreline would you? 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. <laughs> 3 nil, 3 nil, 4 nil. Yeah. Jesus. And of course, I hope we're wrong. Oh, of course, yeah, of course I do. I don't want we won't be. I'm, I'm confident that that will be on the, another defeat. Quite a heavy one as well, I think. Yeah. Good, man. Do, you, do, do you know what do makes you it? Do you think Man United have got three and four goals in them? Though? 100% against think, us. They've probably got about 20. I think we have that bad. No, not necessarily bad in... Individually, but they're just not playing together at the minute. Here's a question for you, right? If let's just say we're gonna get beat, right? We're gonna we're gonna lose, right? I know you think we're gonna draw, but uh, would you <laughs> rather don't. lose? Would, <laughs> would you rather lose one nil? Would you lose? Well, lose one nil, or get beat five? But at five, if I could give you it now. But at five, because then, I, well, Bruce logically, you think Bruce that's might leave his dad for Willis. And I've never, it, Mark, I'm with you on this. I've never ever wanted to see us get battered. But if we're gonna lose the game. It's all if zero points. If, if, yes, if, if you we get beat five nil, there's more chance of him getting losing his job than getting beat one. Because if we lose one nil, Charlie and Ashley, hey, that was Harry. That was canny. That it depends really on the well. performance, doesn't it? If you if you lose, if you're unlucky to lose one nil, then you then that's what you think. You think, well, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll probably have a chance, but we've said that a lot this season. Ashley won't even watch the game if he sees it's one nil. Hey, turn Harry there. The players must still be behind Bruce. Well, it's only one. That's enough. But even, even getting beat, does that put enough pressure on? Well, I don't. I don't. To do, probably not. To do something. I, I, not. Honestly, I don't think it does. But if you get beat five 0 off Man United, then got beat five off Chelsea the following week. That's fifteen goals in three games. <laughs> it's fifteen goals, and I, there'll be there's got to be questions then from the top. There should be questions. Almost there should be, but that's no. I know there should, should be questions. Now but if you get beat one 0 off Man United and get beat two 0 off Chelsea, you're still in the job. It's fine. Do you know what makes this even more frustrating? That we're all walking twelve mile to get there. <laughs> Have you seen the weather forecast as well? Pissing oh, down. It's, it's okay. Pissing awful. down. Bring your brodies. Bring your golf brodies. <laughs> Change your clothes. I'll let me take our woods brody first. I'm, I'm 100% wearing waterproof oh, So yeah, jacket, if you don't know, we're, we're pushing trolleys full of food to Newcastle. Food I'm, bank. I'm, I've, I've changed my mind. I'm boycotting Man United. It's from I'm South getting Shields. On, getting on board with a boycott. From South Shields to St. James' Park. It works out around about 12 miles. Last time it took about three and a half hours. I thought we did it well last time. We did do it well. We would have got there two and a half hours if it wasn't for Decker taking selfies every five minutes. Hey, what a fucking awesome. <laughs> you, you're the one that had your phone in your hand all the time, fucking rattling on. As I was pushing the trolley along. Oh, yeah, shame, man. I was in bloody Wardley while you were leaving Jack. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute lies. Absolute lies. Right, see you later. <clears throat>